Hey guys, how you doing out there? I'm Don. Welcome to the channel Rockin' a Country. I'm doing a subscriber request today, and I and uh, it's a very special subscriber, Donna Lou Stevens. And so shout out to you, Donna Lou. Thank you for this request. I don't know the artist or the song that you've requested, but I'm guessing they're going to be good because those of you who follow the channel know that I did a song called uh, I did a reaction to a video about two or three months ago called Older Ladies. And Donna Lou Stevens, that's her song, her video. She's the star of it. And, uh, and she hammed it up, appropriately so. But she requested this song. So I'm like, hey, if one of the stars of the channel requests a song, I'm going to do it. So let's just do this. And I love, love, love doing new artists that I don't know. I don't know how popular or not they are. I haven't heard of them. But I'm not a reflection of the broader community necessarily so let's see Oop. song is a while oh very cool okay. i could baby i think that i could i could lie this love and for a while I know who the twins are. stuff but how would you categorize this music because there are all different genres and subtypes you know like i did a, a review to uh, joelle sonier a couple weeks ago and, or a week ago maybe and i was like well that's cajun but i mean there's different types of cajun and da -da -da -da. but i don't know within this like how would you categorize this i mean I, obviously i would say country but is there is there a sub region where this is pre more uh, played more predominantly. Here we go. I could, baby, I think that I could, I could lie. This loving for a while. I forgot what it felt like to feel like this, and I could feel. Baby, this one's gonna be good Feel 
sounds like. <laughs> At first, I thought it was a brother sister twins thing until they pan back, and then you saw the two ladies who look identical. But isn't that what it feels like, though? We're spinning when you're, this one's going to be good when you, you know, the way I took the song is, I mean, there was so much to take in. It was like a, um, oh God, a sense explosion, sensory explosion, because I'm looking at like where they shot it. I'm not, I'm trying to figure out where the, what city is. I couldn't recognize that, but then they're shooting it. I'm sure you need no permit to shoot it in that spot. They found an empty place, uh, a parking garage, you know, top of a parking garage or a building that's been gutted or being built. I don't know. And then you're trying to take in the lyrics and the music. The music was beautiful. I love the music and the lyrics. Um, I'm thinking about just how much that is what it feels like before you take that fall. Like this is going to be good. It feels like you're spinning. And uh, the two, the way they were dancing, they hadn't committed to each other yet though. That's what I got out of that. If it was symbolic, metaphorical, uh, whatever you might want to call it. But the way the couple was dancing, they hadn't fully committed. They were still feeling each other out and there were no smiles, no big ones. Anyway, you might've caught a little one. And then, but they're just doing the ballroom type thing and playing that dance of, are you the one for me? <laughs> and uh, it was beautiful. It was great. Donna Lou Stevens, thank you for that. Uh, I'm going to leave the link to uh, this video on their channel so folks could go over and check them out because, you know, I'm sure they love some visitors over there and some extra love and support. All right. So what am I going to rate this song? It was so unique to me, creative. I didn't know what to expect, of course, but that had a very distinctive sound, one that I don't remember hearing in the 1,100 plus videos I've done on the channel before. Very distinctive. And then they only showed the, uh, the fiddler, the violinist, you know, coming in later in the video, but you could hear it throughout. You knew that much, but, um, oh, gosh. I liked it. The editing too. I don't know who was in charge of doing the editing in it and the imagery and how they chose it, but I have a feeling some of that, some of it was done without oversight purposely just to get a reaction from the artist, but they went with it, you know, um, some of the little cutesy things they did in there, but the music itself was just beautiful. It was wonderful. So we're going with a 9.1. It's in the nine category. So that goes in the uh, the playlist of songs of nine and higher. So there you go, guys. Donalou Stevens, thank you for turning me on to the Shook Twins. I don't think you requested this song per se. I just think you said Shook Twins. And I went and I grabbed this one. So there you go. Leave your comments. I'll see you on another video. Have a great day. Keep rocking the country. Mm -hmm.